What's going on, YouTube? So it's Martin and Christina from, from Thrift Store, Store Gold. Gold back at you with a live stream. So we're sorry that it's not a video today, but we're gonna we got two big. I'll actually just show you guys. Ah! We got two big bags to go through. So we're not gonna do it like our normal live stream where we talk to the chat the whole time. We're gonna show you guys. We're gonna be disciplined and show you guys this haul, yes. and we're gonna save all the comments to the end. So if you are rewatching, we hope you guys enjoy this. Yes. This is gonna be kind of a new thing we do. We don't know what time we wanna do it yet, if we wanna live stream at noon or seven. So if you could please let us know what's a better time for you. Yes, but, please. But real quick, actually. We're gonna say hi to some people in the chat. Oh, I was, yes. I was gonna say noon might be a better time to show off our clothing though, because it's brighter. It's in better all lighting. Angles, so you might, guys are probably gonna be able to see it a lot better, but um hello to everyone in here we have What's cajun up? thrift beast jen fried hustler All the greats. hobby man brian willing hey. Catherine Dave, davies it's good to see you hobby man uh mikey robin sherry and jeff gordano hello to everyone we are going to break into this hall now though yes um, we love you guys but we have to put you guys on the ignore we gotta ignore you guys for <laughs> just like a half hour or so so save your comments till the end or we will go through the comments at the end if we have some time yes so let's break right into it but yeah so this is two bins trips worth we went wednesday and thursday this week um so this was our wednesday bag we're gonna go through this one first and then we have our thursday one there so you're gonna hold all this stuff i'll right just kind of hold it yeah why right. not so we got I a couple hard goods but hard goods it's hard to keep track of what's hard good. So we're going to mainly show clothing and yes. some hard goods. Uh, so first hard good, we got this little Olaf toy. We like to pick up Olaf and anything frozen anywhere we go. So that was one thing. Might just give that to my cousin and her kids. I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to put all this stuff. Now, just put actually. it right there for now. Okay. Go through these yep. things. And then we found a Nike hat. I seemingly always find vintage Nike hats. Uh, so it's an older new era style, which is actually really cool. Cause new era's like headquarters is actually in Buffalo. Uh, mm -hmm. So if you don't know, our stadium is called the New Era Stadium now uh, because they're here. But so that was a cool find. And then these, I definitely am going to give to my mom. Oh, I didn't know it says Walt Disney World Resort on the side. I was trying to find a year so hard, but they're little tiny, like Donald bobbleheads. They're so cute. I got three of them. Uh, so hopefully she loves anything that's like a smiling Donald. So I picked those up for her. That's fun. Um, next thing we found is a pair of Converse. Uh, these are actually really unique. They have like four different tongues to all of them. Like, oh yeah, crap. Sorry guys. Cajun just reminded me in the comment. I know I'm not supposed to look, but this is actually our new rabbit friend from my boy Stones. He sent it to us. We need to name him though, but we'll say that till after. But I did want to give a quick shout out to my boy Stones for sending us yes, this. We really you. appreciated this. We're growing our little farm family of Bouncy, bouncy animals. animals. Uh, if I said Nike, I meant Yankees. I don't know why I said Nike. I meant New York Yankees. <laughs> uh, well, someone said that's a Yankees hat, not Nike. So <laughs> I don't know what I said, but I meant Yankees. Uh, but anyways, uh, these Converse have like four different tongues on them. So they got the normal black one, this leopard one, a blue leopard, and then an orange leopard. Uh, so really cool. I, and I think that these will go well. Any kind of Converse usually goes well and we can clean up the soles there. So they'll look nice. Uh, but yeah, those are really cool. And then oh. I got this hacky sack for myself because I'm actually pretty good at hacky sacking and I've always wanted a good one. Never was actually going to go buy one, <laughs> but this yeah. is a really actually good one. So I think it's more of like a kid's toy, like a, just a kid's ball, but it works perfect for a hacky sack. And there's no like, <laughs> if you know what a hacky sack is, they the have the, like the mesh and the beads tend to fall out. So this is like a perfect, just like, like, uh, I'm trying to think of cloth. Oh, like there's yeah. no holes to where the little balls can fall out. I knew that would distract Martin. Screw you, Cajun. <laughs> Cajun, come on. All right, All right, but let's break into this. So the clothing that we got now is pretty cool. Uh, this, I'm, we're not sure if we're going to sell this yet because we are Kanye fans. But uh, it's a Yeezy sweater. So it says, I feel like ye. And then it says, I feel like Pablo on the back. Uh, so it's from his tour. I wish uh, it fit but... me. I would definitely keep it. But it's really cool. I can take all the clothes. I'm just gonna wait. Gotcha. So then we found a pair of, I think I'm actually, this sad that the two things we put on top are mine, but <laughs> I'm going to keep these, but they're those like comfy pants, like flowy Stand pants. Stand up right now. Show them. Oh yeah. She loves her comfy pants. I'm getting on my chair. I love my comfy pants. So yeah, anyways, <laughs> got comfy pants on, uh, but they're from Target. I was doing some more research. This a new day is from Target. And then yeah, it's actually new with tag. So I feel bad keeping it, but they're really cute and they're my size. <laughs> then, oh my 
my gosh. These pair of jeans are also <laughs> for me, too. <laughs> but anyways, pair of jeans. They're from PacSun. Uh, now into the stuff that we're selling. So this is really cool, but it's a Harley Davidson motorcycle shirt. It's got a patch on the front, actually, and a patch on the back. Um, it's an extra large, I believe. Yep. Extra large. And then it's a really, like, heavy-duty material. It feels almost like a sweatshirt, but it's a t-shirt. It's so. actually just a large, but... <laughs> but it's really cool so we were excited for that and then somebody actually gifted us these pants they were like hey you want these panda pants panda pants and we were like sure i was like i know the brand yeah I didn't they tell. actually <laughs> ended up being out lrg which we've had a lot of good luck with skater brands so we were like yeah we'll take those and the panda patch is really cool yeah uh next thing oops i'll do this this was another pair of jeans he gifted us yes yeah, so same guy same guy same kind of patch deal too so we have like rose patches and i've actually never heard of this brand it's called Los Angeles Can Can. <laughs> uh, so if you guys have heard of Can Can, please let me know because I've never heard of Can Can before. But they're really cool, like patch, and they have like frayed at the bottom, so really unique. Um, just hold on one second. Oh. And I then close fell. No, you're okay. And then Martin found this really cool single stitch uh, Coca Cola T-shirt, and then it says. Coke, Coke life? A adds life. <laughs> ah, adds life. <laughs> uh, so maybe, but um, <laughs> it's a pretty cool T-shirt. I don't know. It's. I think it'll go well. Probably Simple on Poshmark. Um, oh, sorry. This anyway. is for me. And then yeah, we picked up this army T-shirt for Martin. He likes to pick up some cool shirts. I think that's the YMC. Is that the YMC? No, this is like the army pattern. Oops. Shout out, lot of Josh. My bad. <laughs> was he in the Marines or the Army? I think he was an Army. He's an Army vet. Someone said real quickly, this is a juggling ball. Yeah, to that's perfect. Ball. That's what it was going to be, like a kid's ball or a juggling ball. But <laughs> um, perfect for hacky sacking. Could Someone you asked. Up? Hold on. Oh. Yes, really quickly. I don't mean to inter like not do comments, but single stitch. Oh, boy, this lighting. If you can see here, there's only like one. This is terrible lighting. Here, compare it to this one next one second guys so if you can see there there was like just one stitch line darcy kind of you can just see right there it's just one stitch line whereas this one has two stitches on it uh so this is more commonly found now and not face. every <laughs> single stitch t-shirt has or not every single stitch is vintage martin's better at this than i am you ready you see how the one has just the two, the yellow one has two and the red one, you can't even really see. When you can't see it, a stitch, that most likely means it's single stitch because it could be pulled, like the one <laughs> stitch could yeah. be pulled. But, right, yeah. but anyways, sorry, Darcy, I hope that answered your question about that. Come on, Darcy, you're distracting <laughs> us. Uh, but next we found this, I'll just hold them up and... this Victoria's Secret pink uh, hoodie pullover. It actually blew my mind because it had a Goodwill tag still on it. So it, meant it made it all the way through all the Goodwills uh, and then made it at our bins. But it's actually a really nice hoodie, I think. It has no stains on it or anything, so I was kind of surprised. But really nice. And then I found this bright pink Fila uh, running hoodie. I think this will go well. I think the bright pink is probably what will be a seller point for it. Uh, but it's like a one of those th like running thermal ones. Uh, so, yes. Yeah. Lighting is fine. Okay, good. <laughs> Thank you. Um, but then I found this airy t-shirt, or well, it's actually kind of like a long sleeve, but there is another airy thing in here that I'm probably going to lot this with. Uh, but it's just like a nice striped t-shirt, so nice pickup. This one is actually for me. It's for it's from the Adirondacks or Lake Placid, uh, and it's a comfort color, so I like that. And I love, love, love the blue. <laughs> and Lake Placid. Yes. If you guys don't know, Christina's going to be running a marathon in Lake Placid in the summer. So give her so, good luck wishes for I that. Know. Am I late? Hi, Stones! We gave you a shout-out for the rabbit. Stones! We got your rabbit. Thank we you. It. We're still uh, debating on a name, so you guys can think of names, and then we'll pick one at the end of this um but then this is actually navy blue you guys can't really see but it's uh compared to our hoodie yeah it's a navy see. blue uh but it's michael kors and it's got these like gold buttons on it so really cool there's the camera really cool uh but yeah so that was something we like to pick up like higher end brands oh yeah and then i found this friends t-shirt so this was really neat um martin really loves friends but unfortunately this is a probably like a women's medium so it's not gonna fit in but it's a really cool t-shirt uh I, very <laughs> iconic i feel like that milkshake oh pose. yeah um so match with my friend's shirt yeah. it's cool because we both have a friend shirt now well, I was gonna if she keeps it 
probably won't. <laughs> these were supposed to be. I picked these pants up because I wanted to try new pants, but they just they're probably too big. And I didn't look, but I hate these types of pockets. Oh, the double on pocket. pants. Yeah. Nah, the little one. I need the That's one a, that yeah. like the khaki kind that like swoops down. So not my kind of jeans. We're gonna definitely sell these. What are they? Iron Co. Yeah, I'm not sure. I've never heard of them. You know, you can let us know. <laughs> strap the GoPro to your head for the marathon. <laughs> I was thinking of putting it on my chest. I've honestly. told her many times. I was like, we should just put it on your but chest not... and have like a four-hour, five-hour video. <laughs> would you guys watch yes. that? Christina threw a marathon you raw. You would hear me. Ah, I, I don't know. You guys would hear her puffing and puffing and dying. <laughs> oh. Cover your ears some. But next thing we found is a Banana Republic, uh, like just blouse. I wanted to pick this up because we have a lot of men's Banana Republic that tends to do cool well pattern. for us um and it's really silky so i liked it um yeah and then oh. <laughs> this is for christina <laughs> yes a big life is good t-shirt we love life is good it such, has such a good motto to it uh do what or like what you do do what like it? what you do do what you like yeah do what you like, like what you do. See, I swear, guys, I'm going to have an only collection of Life is Good t-shirts, and that's all I'm going to wear one day. It's really awesome. Hopefully, if I can find enough at the bins. I know. I got like four or five now. I think I have more than him now. But it's nice because I fit in, I fit into the kid sizes. So. <laughs> I know. We find a bunch of kid ones, and she gets to keep them. So. Uh, but then we found this older Wrangler. It says rugged wear on it. It's like a flannel and then khaki outside. So I think this is really nice. Um, I... Don't know if it's vintage per se, but it's definitely an older tag. So I was, was excited to pick that up. And then Martin found these studded Victoria's Secret pink leggings, which is a shock to me that they have all the studs on them still, because if you know, those things don't stay on for nothing. So hopefully that means they're in really good condition. <laughs> <laughs> um, but next thing, this was actually a Forever 21 dress. And it's um, ripped. Huge rip right in it. It's the box. <laughs> but no, uh, all right, so probably not going to sell that now. You can just toss it to the side. Some stuff from the bins is going to have that. Well, if you want to wear it. <laughs> no, it's a rip. We could super glue the rip. Super. <laughs> but regardless, I picked that up probably for a Poshmark sale just because I like to pick up the cuter items for that. Uh, then uh, I found this at the last minute, and it was just so cute. I had to get it. It's Disney. I feel like. Do you want to just turn it up more? Yeah, it's just when you side. back up. It's really dark. Well, I'll just keep it close though. You're good. Uh, but I loved the daisies and the mini and the Mickey, so I just love it. Um, yeah, it's so cute. So we usually do well with Disney stuff regardless, but I just think that's such an adorable shirt. And then here is the other airy pickup that we found. Uh, it's so soft, and if it wasn't a large, I would keep it. And if I didn't find something else to go with it to lot it, I would keep it. But it's just a camo t-shirt. Some then, Levi's. Some Levi's. Uh, we found these. Actually, they have like a cooler. Sorry, I just... She likes the black. Uh... Yeah, the black label on the back. Like it matches the black pattern of the pants. I love it. Um, <laughs> but then I found a pair of polo khaki shorts. Um, so really, really nice. I love that Disney tee. Darcy, I know. It's so adorable. Maybe we'll get it. Our lighting's a little off right now. I Our know. ring light is not staying situated. It's not quite. But then we found this, what is it, golden clasp tie. I've actually never heard of it before. We don't usually pick up ties, uh, but it was kind of unique, so we picked it up from the bins, which I also should probably disclaim, we get, we get no service in the bins, so we can't actually look anything up. So most of the stuff that we do is like on a, a it's whim. It's on a whim. Uh, but it's usually stuff that we've already picked up. And if it is something that I am like really iffy on and i'm like all right should we get it should we not get it uh i will go and find a spot that has service and wait for it i mean <laughs> we get service but it takes like 10 minutes almost so yeah. it's like to spend 10 minutes and look up the one item when there's more items being picked through when there's more stuff to grab it's like throw it in the cart check it afterwards when we're going through if we're still hesitant and we don't want to buy it we throw it if we're like all right it could sell and we bring it home and then we check the comps yes it's just and how we do it we donated probably. <laughs> this one's for me uh, but I like this good motorcycle t-shirt, so yay! Uh, but it's actually really cute. It's a great t-shirt, so Martin is going to love that in the summer. It'll probably be his shirt to wear. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, and then we found another Michael Kors. Uh, this was like, it's like an emerald green blouse. Um, so I don't actually know if Michael Kors clothes, oh, there's deal here at Stanton. I know, I was going to say. <laughs> uh, I don't know if Michael Kors clothes really sell well, but definitely with the name, it probably should have a little bit of a nice price tag. 
But then we found this kids champion t-shirt, uh, definitely a little bit older, really cool. I've never seen that kind of tag before. It's really like old looking. And then it's just kind of like a tank top, like playing with like the yellow and blue as you can see. But last thing like, in this cool, bag, cool find um, was a pair of Carhartt bibs. Um, so they're actually in really, really good condition. Hold on, maybe I could like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah that, that works. doesn't help that works <laughs> uh but they're in good condition and if you guys know anything about carhartt bibs they're very expensive to purchase new and they're also like 150 to like 300 bucks they fall apart like no tomorrow yep, like they, rip. <laughs> they literally rip so easily and like to have uh, the zippers and both everything zippers work the only thing is flip them over there's and like <laughs> i think they were stored away you can literally see where oh, something they can like see. <laughs> <laughs> i mean like right here it probably just sat out in the sun or well, something i mean yeah you can see like oh i'm pointing on the screen you can see like the tag it must have definitely just yeah that's so a perfect thing they got the sun, sun faded yeah for sure. Yeah, and so <laughs> <That's> <laughs> they're really basically brand new, but just Martin will keep the bibs. <laughs> That's the thing. I'm thinking if, about it, guys. If they don't sell, Martin's probably going to keep them just because he does do construction Mine are work. so bad. He does construction work still with his dad and his, yeah, I'm falling apart. Ow. That's the worst part about it, these. And Martin's a kind of a tiny size, so if they fit him, no offense, but like if they fit him, they probably are not the most common size. Oh, yeah. Gosh. There goes ready? our nice $100, $100 flip. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to get sexy. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> you just going to wear them now? I'm going to wear them for the rest of the stream. Why not? They're so comfortable. This we, we are going to sell these. I'm not actually going to keep them because I don't do construction too much anymore. So my bibs do hold up. List them and just use and wear them until they sell. <laughs> <laughs> no, because when I am wearing bibs, I know that I have bibs on. So I'm not cautious one bit. Like <clears throat> when I would wear my bibs, like I would jump in holes, like dirt holes, like onto my knees and stuff. Because I just knew, you know, like I ripped them up so bad. There's a different button here for something. Yeah, this button. It's for like if you want to like. Guys, we're getting too distracted with the bibs. Oh yeah, sorry. <laughs> I don't know. I'm gonna take them off, I guess. Uh, but now My pants are getting hot. We are moving on to yesterday's bin haul. Um, so this we actually our whole plan was to try and film this in one day and do two bins hauls in one day, but it was super slow on Wednesday, so we were like, all right, we're not gonna let that discourage us. We, we made it home in such a good time on Wednesday. We were like, why don't we just go again Thursday? So we went again and it was a much better day for us. We found a lot more uh I think like to sell. Um, I mean like better brands. So Walmart is putting in I'll just keep talking about nothing. No, no yeah, no, no. I was going to say, you I keep like, chatting while I get myself <laughs> set up. Uh, but yeah, so that is actually probably going to be our plan now is to try to hit the bins twice a week. Uh, it's definitely, not even try, but definitely hit the bins twice a week. It's possible for us. We didn't think it was with my work schedule, but we... It's so possible. We time managed it perfectly where it is perfectly possible. And what we're going to be doing for content-wise is posting two videos a week of the gopro on the chest instead of filming like the montage and then the haul we're going to show you guys the haul on a live stream yes so hopefully you guys are enjoying this i feel like people are everyone keeps saying yay good haul. Um, but yeah so now on to thursday's haul the Woo second big bag Our so if you guys were getting bag. bored we're really sorry because there's an even bigger bag to go through uh but all right so Let's to start, start that right off Martin found an Australia t-shirt, so this is pretty cool. Um, I don't, did you plan to keep this one? Or I wish it? I could keep it. It's a little oh. small, but it is, um, it's just like, it's just an Australia t-shirt, so I don't know. <laughs> it's pretty cool. We like um, to support Australia. Yeah, Duncan. <laughs> Duncan. Uh, but this one, someone must have put back. I was so shocked, but uh, it's a Victoria's Secret pink hoodie. I did think it's an hood? extra small. Yeah. That's what actually caught my attention when I went over there. But uh, I think it's an extra small, so we might have to sit on it for a while. Uh, I don't like zip-up hoodies, or else I probably would keep it. But uh, Victoria's Secret pink. And then, what is this? It might be, I didn't, I don't know. Oh, this is another A New Day t-shirt, so Target. So I might keep this one for work. There's a stain on the sleeve that I just saw, so. Oh, nice. <laughs> um... Oh, I actually found this one. This one was really cool. It was actually wrapped up around a bunch of knives, but it's a Marvel t-shirt with, uh, oh boy. 
what Thor, Iron Man, uh, Knight Rider, Spider Man, Hulk. That's gotta be Crossbone. Oh, Venom maybe, Venom, yeah, and then Captain Hulk America. or Captain America. And I would say maybe like it's probably just someone like um, Miss uh magneto or something probably Maybe. someone from x games because marvel is this. with x games because uh, knight rider like why was he but doing? anyways i really like that t-shirt so i picked it up but this was really cool so this bin it was a new bin i'm gonna actually show off this first this new bin <laughs> came out and like we were all standing there and all these people were hold it up again what this oh Probably. stones he'll know <laughs> ghost rider not knight rider yeah that's what he meant <laughs> that's what i meant <laughs> that purple guy with it's definitely H. gotta be Magne Magneto from. But it's an H on his head, not an M. For heavy metal. <laughs> Hawkeye. Hawkeye. Oh, oh, the H. I was. Oh, going so through. then this is Black Widow down here. Oh That's yeah, her with her hair. It's gotta yeah. be. Yeah. Okay. Okay. But anyway, so we're all standing around this new bin, and I saw like thumb holes. Literally, this is all I saw was a sleeve with some thumb holes, and I was like. Anything with thumb holes usually is good. So I picked it up and I didn't even look at it until afterwards, but it was a Nike dry fit running. It's actually really, really nice quality. It's really cool. It's one of those breathable ones. Uh, so I picked this up and threw it on my shoulder. And then I picked this one up right afterwards. I was like, wow, I hit the gold. That's really cool with the Nike behind it. I the... know, and it follows through. Like, it Oh, finishes. that's really cool. Um, but I was super excited because we literally just sold one of those hoodies, almost the same exact, just a little bit different colorway, um, oh, for thirty nine or thirty two ninety nine. So, and then this. Was, this has really, really cool like square patterns. That's what I'm saying. It's got really cool like breathable technology. I feel so. Technology I was really excited about that. <laughs> uh, but then I found this Toy Story T-shirt. Um, so I don't know. Hopefully it goes well. But I, I feel like Toy Story is like a big one now. Someone will love that. Yeah, with Toy Story four out and stuff. But this is Quicksilver. Yeah, this is Quicksilver. Quicksilver. So it's a really nice, just like pocket T-shirt. We like to pick up any kind of skater brands that we can find. Uh, so that's cute t-shirt and then oh this was new with tags from tj maxx so i picked this up probably for poshmark um it's like um like that must this mustard yellow is a very popular color right now so i guess it's one to like be on the lookout for because people will is that a romper it, yeah like it's a... one of those bodysuit thingies with the buttons on the bottom so i hate taking pictures of these it's the worst to put it on a mannequin it's just i was gonna say possible. how do you even put that on a mannequin it's not possible uh, this was just like in a little nice black dress. This is also for Poshmark, actually. Uh, so I'm excited to list this one because oh, well, maybe I can lot it with the other Forever 21 dress. I didn't even realize. Fix it Big up. Brain. <laughs> oh, guess what? PewDiePie is done with Brick today. Oh, okay. he's gonna be posting later. Nice. Zerg. <laughs> Thank you, KJ, for saying Zerg. I could not Zerg. think of. It's not oh. Toy Story. I was going to say it's Z, and then I was like, that's this embarrassing dude. not to know, so I just didn't say it. Love the fuchsia half, half zip. Isn't it so cute? I love it, too. I'm sorry, I don't mean to keep ignoring people. This oh, is but for then, me. Yes, a Lake Placid t-shirt for Martin. You guys know um, Lake Placid. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, but a nice Lake Placid t-shirt. And then this was a Patriots. It's Gronkowski. Oh, wow. It has this number on the front end. Oh, back. yeah. It's Nike, too. Uh, yes, but Gronkowski actually retired, didn't he? No. I don't think Gronk plays anymore. Hey, Siri. Did Gronkowski retire? Rob Gronkowski last played in the NFL for the Patriots during the 2018 to 2019 yeah. season. Oh, wait. Why did he was was he just like retired because he's injured too much then? Probably. That's crazy. Someone's got to let me know. But yeah, that's <laughs> Gronk cool, retired. Man. That's oh, crazy. You. I, know I had no clue. Than you do. I had no clue. I used to love Gronkowski. You know he's from Buffalo. <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, I actually, this, this is, is really me. funny, actually. One of my best friends, ex-boyfriends, was his, like, cousin. And so she would see him all the time at, like, family parties really? and stuff. Yeah. Um, he's so funny. <laughs> uh, but this one's from Martin, so it says Big Ball Sports. And then on the front, I think this is the Yeah, front. this is the front. Soccer is life. He doesn't play soccer, but he's I don't. Fine. But I just really like that. Like that's just the really big cool. graphics is really cool. The big graphic. The, I, <laughs> I think this one's for Martin too. This is another phone for me. No limit, but the back is really cool. Cause I got no, no limits. limits. Front two. It's oh, someone. It uh, if you can see that, it's someone um, mountain climbing. Like there's someone. Mm. 
Mm. Like over here, you can see him hanging. You see that under yeah. the no? It's really kind of. I, I like we watched a YouTube video of someone like. Uh, it was no, we watched the YouTube Tom Hanks. of Tom. Tom no, Cruise. Tom Cruise <laughs> doing his stunts, and one of his stunts he did. Um, he was rock climbing like by himself, and he just had a harness. He didn't have any safety nets or anything. He wanted to do the stunt by himself. It's crazy. So Drew, if you're still in here, no, no, no. This is about this shirt. Yeah, Drew. Oh, I was gonna put it down. Oh, unless you want me to show. No, you're okay. Is Wrangler Pearl Snap, is that the one we should be on the lookout for? Because that's the one I found. <laughs> uh, but I, it's a pink and small, so I don't know how well it'll sell. But I'm almost positive the Pearl Snap from Wrangler is to be on the lookout for. Um, it's definitely women's. Because it's got the double pockets. Oh, you're right. Yeah. Well, regardless, um, <laughs> real quickly, I'll keep showing this off. Do you want to take it? Out? Yeah. All right, I'll be back, guys. We'll be back. I'm going to keep talking. Oh, my coffee. Uh, I was like, let me get the seat on. Uh, Cajun, yes. The shirts that we got are currently from the bin. So are my pants. My comfy pants that I love. <laughs> um, but next thing that we found was an NBA. Uh, it's like a shirt hoodie. One of those really just lightweight hoodies. Um, so really cool. I like the colorway of it a lot. Uh, if it was NFL, I'd say it was Bills. But it's not. Yes, those are very vintage and desirable. Yes. <laughs> I thought I picked up so many pearl snaps thinking like hoping maybe that it was like one of the vintage ones they're looking for. So I'm really excited now. Um, but next thing that we found, I'm not sure if Martin is keeping this one, but it's a Dr. Pepper t-shirt. <laughs> it says, what's your problem? <laughs> and then... The cure for what ails you. I don't know if Dr. Pepper is a cure for anything, but it's a cool graphic t-shirt. And then we found this women's bills, uh, just kind of t-shirt. This was actually made to have the cut in it. Uh, so someone gave us the tip the other day that when hoodies have the cut in it, it could be for women when they try to like take, you know, like when they do their hair and makeup, they have a bigger hood so you don't ruin it. Um, but this one was actually meant to be in there. So it's pretty cool. Um, and good tip for us because we had no idea that that is what they did with hoodies. You think I would know? I used to do my makeup all the time. Uh, this is an Under Armour tank top workout hoodie or workout t-shirt. Dr. Pepper sweater is awesome. And it's pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. Uh, but then we found this Under Armour tank top workout tank top. I'm probably going to keep this for myself, although it looks a little bit big. But uh, I like to work out and stuff like this. And then I found a Puma hoodie at the last second. So this was really nice to find. Uh, it's in actually really good condition and like... These things are tight. Like it still has I'm like keeping that Dr. Pepper. Uh, well, they said it was cool. <laughs> uh, it still has like almost like the tag was supposed to be there, but it was ripped off. So I don't know. But uh, it's really soft on the inside, so really nice. And then I think this is for Martin. Too. See you later, hobby man. We love you. Bye. Um, day of caring. I believe this one's for Martin because he's all about caring. <laughs> but it, oh, it's from 1994. That's why, too. It was Camping. from 94. That's pretty cool. Um, is it single stitch? It is single stitch. So, Ooh. look at this is another way you can see single. That one's very clear. Ah, there you go. Yeah. Maybe the Coca Cola shirt, it was like actually ripped off, like I said. <laughs> Uh, but I found a romper. I actually found two of them. I should have picked up both of them and sold one on eBay, but I picked this one up for me because I like stripes. <laughs> she likes stripes. Uh, next, this is actually the very first thing that I found. And oh, onto that hoodie tip that I was just giving you guys with the cuts in it. Uh, this one was 100% not meant to be like that and made into at least... I don't know, actually. It looks so perfect that it, like, could be, but also, it's like... It's ripped right yeah. You never know. I feel like maybe it was a little bit like that, and they made it farther down or something. <laughs> I don't know, but... Uh, maybe they had big, poofy hair that yeah. they didn't want to... Uh, it says, love pink on the back, and it's just, like, a nice purple color, so I picked that up. But it was one of the first things that I found. Very nice. And then this, I'm keeping for myself. It's just, like... It's a Walmart brand, Athletic Athletic Works, I don't know, but it's so soft. This is the softest hoodie that I have ever felt in my life. It's like a cloud, so I just love it. Um, and then... Oh, this is... I found this. 
this is really cool. It's a Muppets t-shirt. I love rock and roll. <laughs> so really cool. It actually has an not an older tag, I wouldn't say, but it's not a vinyl tag. It's so Disney. I know. But it's pretty it's like a cool tag. It's like a cotton tag. Yeah. It's probably meant to not rip off and not be itchy, you know. Mm. This was cool. I found this. I found this one. I was like, this is a cool one. But uh I think it's it's oh, a no. riot scoutly. Oh, yeah, Riot Society. I don't know what that is, but that little bear with the sunglasses is pretty dang cute. So, and the red solo cup. <laughs> yes, I thought it was really cute. Uh, but then I found this. I found oh, this. Oh, actually, no, Martin found this. I'm keeping this one because the back says puppy love. Look at how cute that is. Oh, man, I want to wash. It I looks mean, like Finn, too, with I his know. ear. I want to wear this to work today. Uh, can't, though. This was really cool. This is from Disney Paris, oh, wow. uh, but it's Discover the Stars, and it's Donald Duck and then uh, Chip and Dale on here, so it's really cool. It's an anniversary. I know. I <laughs> you gotta watch the back of it. Don't want to get it. Uh, but it's from Disneyland Paris, so really, really wow. exciting. That's yeah. really cool. Um, and then... I this is for me. Oh, yeah. I, I, was, I just like finding these... Um, you guys can't even see, but it's an all-black crew neck. <laughs> so there's actually just um, fruit of the loom, but it's an extra large. So we can never, it. when we go to, like, anywhere we go to find them, like AC Moore's used to have them or Walmart, we only find the ones with the hood or the zip-up ones. Like, yeah. we can never find just the plain crew neck ones. So it's, like, a blessing when we can find those in good condition. And now we actually never even go to retail stores <laughs> no, to I know. buy I our clothes. Say, so when I do anymore. find it, I'm like, hey, I found it. <laughs> but there's some more Levi's. Yeah. Some Levi's. We always pick up any kind of Levi's. Men's, women's. Nikes, Levi's. Uh, shorts. These are cool. Jennifer will. Yes. I literally tried to put these down she so many tried. times. And Martin was like, no, we have to get them. We guys, these are going to sell because she did the uh, Super, Super Bowl. Bowl. Probably, but. People want her pants now. <laughs> <laughs> but oh, see, another Life is Good t-shirt for me. This one's really cute. I think it's a kid's once too, but it's really cute. It's got little flip-flops on it. So whenever we go to the beach, I'll wear that. This one doesn't have the little tag on the bottom. Ooh. It's definitely a kid's shirt. <laughs> uh, oh, this... Then, this one's for Martin too, but it's really cool. It's got a really cool graphic on the back, like those bright colors. That's really unique. Bright colors uh, tend to catch my eye. <laughs> Uh, then he found a Budweiser tank top. I think this actually is a women's one. It's gotta this be. It's time. too like tiny. Yeah, but we have a lot of men's beer tank tops. <laughs> uh, so hey, maybe we could lot a man's and a woman's together, and like the perfect couple will be like, "That's my size, and that's your size. Let's get it." And they'll pay like fifty bucks for it. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> How do you guys verify Levi authenticity? I didn't know people fake Levi's. We got fake so... Levi's. No, not we, but like there are fake Levi's. Um. I'm going to do more research, but off the top of the head, I'm going to say fake Levi's probably are just noticeable. That, and I just feel like I've done, I've worked with Levi's. Like when I worked at Macy's, I, like the jean Levi section was part of my section at one point, And like, I know the tags very well. Like, I feel like I'd probably be able to stick it. Like, that's what I'm saying. Like, like the horse being different or something. Don't take my word on it, but I feel like if they were fake, maybe the stitching would be like, not as like how it always is, you know, how it's like, um. It's like a half inch or like a quarter inch, like in. Yeah. Maybe it would be all the way to the end or something, or maybe even farther in. I have no clue. I'm gonna do research. That's a great question, Sydney. Thank you. Yes. Uh, really we didn't even though, think about that. Darcy. Darcy loves everything that we found so far in this haul and the last <laughs> haul. So maybe we'll just get a big box and send you everything. We She's love like, you, Darcy. I love this. I love this. I want this. I, I know. want that. I want She said, that. "I'm a striped girl too." Did you see that? <laughs> <No>. <laughs> that was funny. We love you. We love you guys have, um, having such great conversations. Like, this is so amazing. Yes, We're having a lot of fun. It is very amazing. And then this one, I believe, is from Martin because he said he needs more pink in his Me. life. Uh, Not but more it's... pink, but I just don't have really a pink shirt. So, And it's breast cancer, so I'll support I'm that. I'm saying you need more, like, more, like the color well, pink. Saying I need more pink in my life seems a little weird. You don't think? <laughs> no. Uh, but then we found, lastly, was a pair of Adidas sweatpants, so like a big tracksuit kind of just pants. Uh, they're not as soft inside as I thought they would be, but they're made to be, like, not soft. They're, like, uncomfortable sweatpant material. But that was our last thing from that haul. And then I don't think we picked up any hard goods oh. yesterday. Uh, the only Barely thing, any. The only things we picked up, I'll tell you guys now, were, were wooden pieces to thomas the train track sets uh but not the actual thomas the train 
Thomas the Train brand. Uh, so the off brand, and we actually gave them to our friend because their son has a plethora of toy train tracks, and he obviously needed some more. And so we gave him some more. Oh, hold That's on. Why he I was need crying. to go let Stormy upstairs. Our cat was actually under the couch, so that's why Finn has been crying like the whole time. Where'd she go? She probably went into the back room. So that was our haul. We hope you guys really enjoyed us showing that off. That was um kind of like how we usually do it. Not actually, that was not how we usually do it. Usually we do it behind the camera and Christina will show it off. I'm rambling now because I'm by myself. Oh, so coming. she's coming. I actually did find these yesterday. Some uh, just a bag of clips because clips. you can always use clips. So these will come in handy, like in my camera bag and stuff. For like, say we're just I don't know. This is right off the top of the head. Say we're like filming or something, and I'm trying to get this light in. I need to take a cord and like clip it to something. It'll be perfect. Ah, you know, that's just you. that was my first thought. Is like, oh, this will come in handy for like some type of filming something. Yeah, for so sure. So little clips I can throw like a bunch in my bag and then keep some around the house. But real quickly, I hope you guys. I know Martin already said this, but I hope you guys enjoyed that haul for real. Like, mm -hmm. I hope it wasn't too rushed, too annoying for you guys. I hope it did work well. You could see everything. Yeah. Everyone's saying that they had great haul. So we're actually not going yet. So don't yeah, worry. We're not we're done. We're still gonna be talking to you guys for a little bit if you want what to. What time is it? That was our plan. Oh, cool. Uh, it's 12.43, so I have to stop this probably around 1-ish so I can go to work. Yeah, she's got to work at 1.30. <laughs> <laughs> yes, uh, but it works out really well. I mean, this morning we woke up at around 8. We got to the gym a little bit, and then I went over to Danielle's house, and we hung out. She made me eggs, Benedict. Really? Yeah. Of course. <laughs> That's funny. Thank you, Danielle. Yes, thank <laughs> if you you're watching. so much. Uh, she's actually probably grocery shopping right now because, <laughs> yeah. But uh, he, their little son showed me all the train tracks that we got him last night. So we were playing with all those. It was really fun. I don't know if she sent you the picture or not, but we were trying to play Mario Kart. And I was so blind. I was like, I can't see. And then I didn't know what buttons to push. And Ben was trying to, like, explain to me. And, like, she was like, well, maybe it'll be a fair race then. <laughs> I was like, yeah, probably. I suck. Uh, but Thrifting365 asked me what kind of work I do at my other job. I actually work at a, it's called a mini ship, so like a shipping hub. Uh, so I basically pack stuff up when I'm not packing stuff up at home. <laughs> she ships other people's orders out when yes. she's not shipping hers. Uh, so that that's what I do. I really do enjoy it a lot, though. It's part-time from 1.30 to 6, Monday through Friday, besides Wednesday. And it's just a really good job for me, so... Uh, but now we'll get to all these comments in here. Hi, Steph! What's up, Steph? We love you. We love Arizona. You're the, we're so jealous of you. Every time we see you, we're like, dang, she's actually living in Arizona. Um, hello, <laughs> Hazel. Thank you so much for coming in here. I saw what's up, her what's saying up? a great haul. What's up, Dana? Hi, Dana. Uh, Robin says, loving that Dr. Pepper t-shirt, <laughs> Donald Duck Paris one as well. Very good haul. I know. I all. honestly might keep the Donald Duck Paris one just because I want an all-over print shirt, and that's really cool. I might keep it. You should only keep it for my mom. You That's what I was going to say. I'm going to keep it and wear it around your mom so she likes me more. No, yes. I'm just kidding because she doesn't like me. Uh, <laughs> In-laws, you know what I'm saying? Nah, because <laughs> Mama Gold is amazing. But anyways, <laughs> not that my mom's not. I just mean like for in-law wise, like I got very lucky. But uh, hold on, go down a second. Uh, do you want me to just grab my mouse? or? It's, right here, oh, it's upside down. <laughs> I was laughing at this. Darcy goes, love a man secure enough to wear some pink. <laughs> I like pink. I have to just deal with whatever he wears now because there's some crazy t-shirts. But it's cool because, like, I don't know, like, it almost makes this, like, stand out a little bit. Like, when he's got, like, this really cool, like, graphic t-shirt on or something that's older because, like, people don't wear that nowadays. And I mean... I really haven't had the chance because our weather is so cold that I always yeah. have to keep a hoodie over it. So I'm more excited to start getting into that once the weather breaks. That is very true. So we're really excited for... Oh, my God. Okay. We are really excited for summer. I actually... So the other day we were cleaning out our closet and I was cleaning out my t-shirt portion of it and moving it to another section. I have so many cool t-shirts. You guys That's are going to die. <laughs> I'm literally so excited. I know. Like, I have a lot of cool t-shirts, but I have to wear these long sleeves because it's cold out. It's freezing. <laughs> Craving Dr. Pepper now. Honestly. That's funny. I think I got Dr. Pepper last night instead of Pepsi when we went to Burger King. Um, and it was really good. What's Hello, up? Brett. Very nice.
nice to see you in here. My first time on anyone's live. That's really <laughs> awesome. These are the live shows. You get to comment while we're sitting here. Yes. Hello, hello. We Style. really appreciate oh, you coming in. Style points. Do Thank one you. of us look stylish right now? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe the pink <laughs> when I wear it. Um, let's see. What system? Mario Kart, Wii, Switch? <laughs> I was Game playing Cube. on a GameCube. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, so hello, Cindy. Very nice what's to up, see what's you up? in here. Um, I like how y'all were still interactive with the chat a little bit. Okay, good thing. I like that you said that because I was really worried that like, if we didn't the OGs say anything, weren't gonna like it. <laughs> yeah, like you guys weren't gonna like it or something. But we did tell you we were like we live stream almost every day, so you guys have to be okay with us not talking to the chat for uh, like a half hour. All the funny shirts equal style points. Ah, ah yes. yes. Thank true. you. Thank you. <laughs> Steph said she's she said, I feel you won't be jealous when it's 125 degrees. Nope, outside we'll still be jealous. <laughs> <laughs> mm. I mean, it's like 30 degrees out right now. I don't think it is even 30 degrees. Let's see. It's warm. It's sunny, but it's freezing. 28. Oof. I'm about to sneeze. Hold on. Look into the light. Stare into the light. <laughs> Bless you. Thank you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Stone says he's listing anyways. I'm glad you're listing. Were you even able to look at anything that we picked up? <laughs> <laughs> a lot of people just put us on the back end. That's okay. We actually really appreciate that. Yeah. We think that that's really, like, we were talking about this the other day, and it's, like, really kind of crazy that, like, people will listen to us. Where is Finn? Was, I'm going to go find Finn. <laughs> but I'll continue. <laughs> yeah. It's really crazy that um people like to just, like, well, no, it's actually inspiring and really cool that people like to watch our videos while they do work, and it keeps them motivated and stuff. So, like, we never even thought that was going to be, like, a thing. What? He's terrorizing Stormy. Oh boy. He's probably keeping her cornered in the closet. He did. She was cornered in the little room and he was barking at her. All right. Come on, Finn. I'm going to grab him for you guys. Sorry. Sorry for the dead stream. I'm bringing the fat man so he could say what's up. Um, Should do a what he wore pick collage from him in different shirts 30 days worth see i really want to do stuff like that um like take a picture every day and then after like however many days or weeks like <clears throat> or months we like compare them all but i just never like stick to something like that ouch 28 degrees that hurts yeah no it you oh whoa you go outside and it physically hurts your skin. It's the worst. It's horrible. We have to bundle up before you do anything. You wake up in the morning and you instantly have to put like long sleeve and a hoodie on because it's just cold. We got to turn the heat up. We got to get in a hot shower. <laughs> hey, Megan said beagles, especially older gray ones. Yes. <laughs> yes, we love our uh, beagle. He's super nice. I'm going to hold him and keep looking at him. Oh boy, she's having some problems. We're sorry, guys. It's 72 here. Oh, that just sounds perfect. See, I know that's a little chilly for you, but for us, that's like almost like the hottest it gets in the summer. He's so fat. No, it's not. Gets up to like 97 here. All right. I'm fine. She was shaking. <laughs> he literally was terrorizing her. Oh boy. Well, at least they know Bye. each other now. Yay. But, anyways, yeah. So we have a cat. We got a cat. <laughs> Her name's Stormy. She's very shy right now. Uh, the crazier the shirts, the cooler. And everyone enjoys being in your company, I've noticed. Ah, uh, I'm new to thrifting and your videos at Goodwill Bins helped. Yay! That's so awesome. Thank you so much for that. We love hearing comments like that. We love being able to help people out. And just like when people realize that like we are just like our normal selves and we're not like anybody different i don't know you know no, like it's literally just us you're getting what you get you get what you get, get. <laughs> we really appreciate you your dog pictures of him on some customer merch that'd be different people would love those we've thought about it we we definitely have plans to like get his face like printed on a shirt and stuff like that and selling that but that's just like down the future more <laughs> if we did it right now it'd be like too rushed like i've tried yeah. to make merch and stuff but once we really just like feel like the time is right for sure yeah we definitely want to it'd be really cool i, mean, I think it'd be so awesome we're wearing a shirt with finn on it oh like... no think about it would be super cool if we if we made like oh if we had like a thousand orders or something you know and mm -hmm. we just sit here and we'd be like wow 
there's a thousand people out in America or wherever in this world, like wearing fin shirts right now. Like that would be cool. It would be crazy. Look at him just lick his lips. It's because I'm scratching his thigh. He, anytime like I scratch <laughs> his thigh, he likes to just. <laughs> uh, but uh, it's to over the years. Hello, over the years. I've never seen you Wait, in here. What? Oh, doggy. Hey, what's up, over the years? <laughs> hello, hello. Um, hold on. Cindy said Stormy was the perfect name. So cute. I yes. know, right? It was all me. Her name was Kitty Cat before. So and Misty. Misty and was the official we, name. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but now it's Kitty Cat. I mean. Now it's stormy. <laughs> uh, you two are awesome. Stopping by to say what's up, guys. We Thank really you. appreciate that. We appreciate that so much. Finn, are you getting toasted? Um, I guess we'll see if there's any comments during we were talking. How much time we got left? Eight, Eight minutes. minutes. If that. Um, our binge just moved. There's no service there. Have guest Wi-Fi. That works good. Thank oh, goodness. wow. You have guest Wi-Fi? Maybe we have guest Wi-Fi, and I just have never known. If we do, and I'm not taking advantage of it, I'll be so upset. Something we would definitely want to start doing when we can spend a little more extra money and stuff is buying Wi-Fi for her car. Yes. And it's $5 a day, but there's got to be, like, some type of, like, monthly no, I subscription. I used to have a $20 a month for yeah. unlimited plan. Okay, cool. So yeah. we're just going to get Wi-Fi from her car, park close, like, as close as we can to the door of the bins, and hopefully no, I get signal that. No, I Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, that's such a killer. <laughs> a buzzkill. Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, yeah. But, um, yeah. Um, so, I, actually, the top comment that we had back there was about uh, the marathon. And Kate just mm. said, I'll be there for you. Do you mean you're going to come to Lake Placid? <laughs> Are you going to come to Lake Placid to cheer Christina on? That would be kind of crazy. Oh, actually, so really... Oh, you can click on that. Read that. You guys make the bins look fun. Visit the Los Angeles location, and believe me, it's a wild place. <laughs> no, I the people at mine like already frustrated. They're me already wild They're, enough. Like, getting in my face, so I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> what were you gonna say? Um, I have had to save two dogs in our neighborhood the past two days, and I'm sick of it. They this, just went running on the street. This is a PSA to everybody. If you have a dog and they like to run away. Get a higher fence. Huh? Yeah. yeah, like I this dog that we have next door, he's so cute. His name is Manta. He is like a Scooby Doo dog. Like he is huge. humongous. Okay. Huge. He's probably weighs more than I do. Um I was taking Finn on a walk yesterday. Sorry, I just hit him in the face. And I was down at the end of the other side of our street and I saw this dog hop his fence. Hop over the street and like do hops into like the guy's like uh driveway across the, the street. Neighbor across the street. And I was like Oh my gosh, I know that they're not home. And so I looked at Finn and I was like, I'm sorry, bud. And we booked it full pace, like as fast as we could. And like Martin and I and the neighbor across the street were outside for probably 45 minutes yesterday trying to get this dog to get back inside. Luring and him with treats. Luring, and like he was so nervous that he was just like upset, you know, like he was just anxious you know like oh yeah you'd go up to him and he'd just be all scared and start barking at you yeah. and this was a big dog like if he were fin size i would have just went right up to him and grabbed <laughs> yeah, him I know. but this is a big dog like i'm not it probably i think it's a great dane i think yeah, that's what that some type is. of like great dane mix yeah but so regardless huge freezing outside it's snowing and then finally we got him into the yard neighborhood <laughs> yes we're a neighborhood watch for the dogs oh, and crap. then today I'm driving down the street and I see our neighbor's dog, like a different one, a few houses little down. Dog. Little tiny chihuahua. I see him in the other yard across the road and I'm just like. And this dog's always out. Like, this isn't <sighs> the first time we've had to save this no. dog. And so. Is my old buddy's. Is my best friend, actually, who I don't even talk to anymore. He lives in New York City. He lives on the same street as me. His parents do, actually, I should say now. Yeah. And their dog gets out all the time. So, Nate, if you're watching, get control of that dog. <laughs> no, so, so, okay. So, I literally, I was going to stop my car and be like, come on, Darren, like, get in the car. <laughs> oh, he might be upstairs. No, my coffee. Oh, um, so I was like, uh, no, forget it. Like, I'm just going to go and, uh, like, park my car because we live really close. So, I parked my car. I got out. I started booking it towards this dog. And I'm like, Darren, like, oh. I just hit my elbow. <laughs> Shout out Stones for the coffee. It's really good. Yes, thank you. But I was just like, Darren, come on, come on. And he just, boom, right across the road. And I was like, come on. 
run. He's little and, and so, fast. He's little and fast. And so I like I got him to the point where he was running and then just ran into his yard and then uh Gavin came outside and he was like this Darren! Five year old comes the same the day. Yeah, and I was like, Oh thank you. I was just about to open up my the door and let him in but uh i was just like yeah i can't like make sure you keep him inside you know like do not let him outside ricardo get back to work <laughs> you're not I allowed know, to watch school. us while you're at school yeah, i know so many people in here <laughs> we're sorry ricardo we did not think about school time no. and that you're in school if we live stream early we didn't. we're sorry ricardo <laughs> But all in all, I'm glad that I was able to be there for both those situations because yeah. as a dog owner myself, I know I would be devastated if I came home one day and Finn was not here. So if that, like, I don't care whose dog it is, I will try to save your dog if I see it running around. <laughs> but it's just like crazy that in two days, both of those situations happened. And you like, just happened to be outside for both of them? I like I actually, I was telling Martin this morning, how crazy is it that I was... Yesterday, I wasn't going to take the walk with Finn. I was like, nah, like, just not feeling it. It was freezing outside. And then Martin decided he was going to nap. And so I was going to take a really short walk. I didn't nap. Thanks, Drew. <laughs> you woke me up from my nap to edit you some photos. For some <laughs> thumbnails. Shut up. I'm <laughs> leaking that. But uh, anyways, Taking and then I away. took a longer route around. And even almost on my turn home, I was like, nah, let's just, like, take Finn a little bit longer. So I took a longer route home. And it's just crazy that, like, at that moment that I was Turning onto our yeah. street, I saw that. Like, just coincidence, but I'm glad it was me and not anybody else who was mean or would have taken the dog ban or anything like that. So I'm glad I was able to save him. Cajun, you're right. You got so, it. Oh, yeah, we got to name the rabbit. Yes. What is this? I used to have a dog that was an <laughs> escape artist. No no matter what I did, he would fi still find a way to jump over the fence. That's so I know. I was going to say, I shouldn't say that to everyone because, like, that dog would probably find a way. It, it opened up the door and they got have outside. To, well, they used to have a big problem where it would open the door and get outside. So now they have a deadbolt for the door. And he said his wife might have just forgot to do it Lock this morning it, or yeah. something. But, I mean. How, how is a dog that smart? Finn can't even figure out where his food is. He probably just open. jumps up and hits the thing. <laughs> He's a big dog. The big dog. Like, uh, Great Danes and... Uh, I can't think of the other ones, but Great Danes and like other dogs have been known to open up fridges and doors to let them out. <laughs> Could you imagine your out. dog opens up your fridge and eats everything? I know. Rabbit, oh. you have one of those too. No, we got a new. So if you guys are new here, we had a hippo bouncer named Bert. Named Bert that is currently in Los. No, I'm sorry. Currently in Louisiana with Cajun right now. And I'm extending your shipping label time because you were so sassy last time but i'm gonna give it to you tomorrow and you're gonna have to send them out but anyways we have a bouncer that's currently in louisiana with uh kj reseller right now who is showing him around louisiana we found and, him at the bins our first time yes <laughs> and so over the time going to the bins we have found kurt and then uh kurt is a cow and then yesterday we got in the mail a rabbit from <laughs> our boy uh, stones our boy stones so thank you so much it's so funny it's so it's honestly the best duty one that yeah they're, like it's better duty than Kurt. <laughs> and it's like um it's like a basketball pump one it's not the plugs like it's not these, these silly ones. plugs but anyways <laughs> i think somebody said it but i like the name wilson I know Someone that, did say it was Darcy. I know, that, I know that doesn't go with Kurt or Bert. I was gonna tell but you. But like that, Kurt, like, Bert, and Wilson. Yeah. I think that just goes good, like you know? It. Or I, it would be like Chris, we Robert. should name it. No, we should name it Chris after my boy Stones. <laughs> Chris, I like that. Or we could just name, name, it, name it Stones. Stones. I like Stones. Stones. <laughs> Let's see. Let's do Stones. What do you guys like? Stones? I like we can name him Stones Wilson. What I'm thinking, Stones, um, Stones, Robert. Why Robert? So it rhymes with Kurt and Bert. Or what's like, mm. Rert. Rert, no. <laughs> Stones, Rert. I like Stony. We can Stones and Stony. Stony because you are Post Malone's nickname is like Posty. No, I thought it was Stone. No, it's Posty. That's There's... what Justin Bieber calls him. I know, but there's something with him that is stony, I think. But regardless, I like stony or stones. <laughs> stones and stony. <laughs> I like Sturt. that. Sturt. <laughs> Stone, Sturt, Kurt, and Bert. Stuart. Nah, I like, I like, um, I like stones. stones. Stones is a good one. Stones and stony. Bert, like Kurt, and stones. And then we have Finn and Stormy. 
<laughs> That's a good name. I like it. Stones the rabbit and Kurt the cow. Who's Kurt the cow. a little bit. Yeah, we need to blow him up some more. And we got yes. Bert the hippo. Bert, he'll be back soon after he travels with Lonzo for a little bit. We need to get him there. But plus, he's gray like stones. I know. That's what I was thinking. Gray. What? He's gray like stones. What did I say? You said great. I thought I you said, said gray. gray. No. He, he is great. Stones <laughs> is a great guy. <laughs> no, gray. Uh, but... On that note, we actually do have to go because I have to go get ready for work now. We're going to wrap it up now. We hope you guys had a great time with us on this yes. afternoon. We had a really fun time hanging yes. out with all of you guys. We had like over 20 to 30 people in here the Max, whole time. Sleepless Hustler is going to be really upset that he missed this. So We're I just want to say it now. I'm sorry. We love you. We love you. But <laughs> on that note, we hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. Yes. Whatever time of day you got left, make sure to crush it. Make it yours. Be happy. And we'll catch you guys. Our next video is going to post not till Monday on this channel. But we might do some live streams on our other channel. So you never know. Yes, we love know. you guys. We're glad we're... we got to catch everybody that was in here. Yes. Hopefully everyone has a great and safe day. And thank we'll... you for the fun. Wait. Thank you for the fun. Thank you. <laughs> All right. We'll see you guys Happy later. Friday. Peace. Enjoy your weekend.